Hi, I'm Nerida Conway. I'd love to introduce you to Sean Cummings from the Park Hyatt. Hi, Sean. How are you? Oh, fantastic. Great to be here. Now, we are here to serve up some smiles to some seriously ill children via the amazing Starlight Children's Foundation. Now, what's happening is that uh, people can have a party. They can have a party in their office, at their home, anywhere they like. They can charge top dollar to all of their peeps to come along and um, that money can actually be donated to the Starlight Children's Foundation. It's a great cause. It is. Fantastic And it can ju they really make such a difference to people's lives who are just in turmoil. And um, one thing coming into the silly season that would be mm. a fantastic idea is to make up some beautiful stylish canapes that are easy, because that's the trick, and serve them up. So you're very kindly agreed to show Absolutely. us some little tricks. Okay. Well, to start with, I think you should kick it off and make the first one. Oh, good Lord. Okay. Okay, actually, first what we're going to do is we'll get angry. We'll get angry with our partner oh. over here. So all we want to do, deconstruct no, it, we're just going to so smash it up. Nice little shards. So that's the easy part. Okay. Nice little chunks. Then, if you don't mind. And so if you are actually not into making pav, yeah. pavlova base, you could actually just pre-buy the Very simple. case, couldn't you? in the supermarket. If you're a little bit um, you know, short on time, that's an easy option. Yeah. Cheat a little bit. Yeah. This okay. is a very quick, uh, very fast dessert, so you know, let's knock it over. Okay. Do you want to start with a little bit of the diced fruit? So right. you can use any type of fruit that you want. Uh, this one we've got some strawberries, some melon. How much? Just about a spoon? Just a little bit, yeah. Like, is that too might, much or enough? No, that's fine. That's enough. And we'll kick in with a little bit of um, yogurt. So this is just a, a plain uh, vanilla yogurt. Okay. A little bit of that. And you just want to layer it up. So we'll put a little bit of this uh, passion fruit in there as well. A few shards, a few shards of the um, of the the pavlo, the macaroon. Okay. Now. At yeah, this point. yeah, absolutely. Okay, a little bit more of the passion fruit, a little bit more of the pavlova, and we've made some little mini ones here, which we'll just garnish. Oh, but what could I use if I didn't have some made at home? Or well, you could just finish it off with the shards as well. Yeah, you know? it does look nice. A little, a little tiny bit of um, fresh mint on top as well would be nice. But, you know, this is the sort of thing. You just want to keep it simple. Gosh. Keep and look cute. at that. So you'd lay these out on the table. You know, the colours. That looks amazing. And what a great summer dessert for anyone anyway. It's quick. This is a sort of kids' parties. Oh, you know, yeah. It's, as soon as you throw meringue on in front of a child, they just oh, yeah, they go nuts. inhale it. So or me, there's not a, lot of, not a lot of sugar in that other than in the meringue, so that the fruit's not sweetened. Um, you know, the passion fruit's just straight out of the out of the passion fruit. So the yogurt is, um, you can sweeten it with a little bit of honey if you yeah. like, but I, I find with the, the sugar content it's, in the pavlova, yeah, it's, it's not enough. too sickly. So yeah. you know, it's a really fresh summer dessert. Oh, yeah.